Hey guys, <clears throat> just wanted to put out another video. Um, we got pike season, northern pike season approaching um, first Saturday in May um, here in New York. And I haven't done anything, any fishing videos or any tackle lures in quite a while, so I wanted to get something out since I just picked some up, picked up some of these spinner baits. Um, I just put an order in, just got these back from Cabela's, um, Bass Pro Cabela's, as they now call it. I liked it, I liked it better when it was just Cabela's, frankly. Um, their website kind of sucks right now. Um, it was better as Bass Pro. So anyway, that aside, um, bought some Booyahs, um, spinner baits, 3 8 ounce for Pike. Um, Northern Pike. I gotta replace these every year since they get torn up. Even the little pike will tear them up. And um, obviously, spinner baits are still one of the uh, the, the mainstays of Northern Pike fishing, lure fishing. Um, so I picked up four, five, I guess five. <clears throat> I picked up uh, the Booyah Pikey in uh, chartreuse and orange, three eighths ounce, double willow blades. Um, this is usually the one. Usually, I'll get multiple um, of these spinner baits, the pikies, <clears throat> because of the closed eyelet at the top, which prevents it from sliding up and down the line. Uh, they only had one in stock, believe it or not, so I just got that and another three-eighth ounce spinner bait with a Colorado blade, silver, and a willow gold. The eyelet is not closed so these will slide up and down the line a little bit but they're okay they're still good um i don't think they have trailer hooks on any of these um yeah i can't tell okay i know the strike kings have them so got the strike king and 7 16 ounce one large colorado um blade dimpled blade uh, I needed a dark spinner bait I like the lights but sometimes the darks work well in, in uh, dark conditions moving along another strike king this is 3 8 ounce normally I get 3 8 ounce or half ounce I used to go all the way up to an ounce and a half um, I used to order them strictly from Cabela's and they had trailer hooks um, uh, but an ounce and a half crank uh, um, spinner bait is tough to throw. Gets caught up in the air, catches a lot of wind, and it's, it, even though it's heavy, it just it doesn't throw. It goes up there like a like a kite and lands about 20 feet in front of you. So I've gotten away from them. Also, the distance between the hook and the blades themselves is a longer distance. And I've had pike take the the blade, the um, the blade side of things, and miss the hook. I don't know I, on many occasions. Big pike. Um, so I, I've mainly been going three eighths to one half ounce, three quarter ounce to also, but um, they're all about the same size. They're big enough. Okay. And moving right along, another three eight ounce booyah, double willow. Um, not an enclosed eyelet, unfortunately, but it'll it'll do the trick. And um, that's it. Pike season is right around the corner, and these will be used for sure. Okay, tight lines.